Well, hello. I'm Zach the Wacker Mate 75 FM1, and welcome to Juan on One, hashtag One Step Forward. Now, recently we had Parangal, Bayanihan, at Samahan, and that was more of like an online concert series for all our frontliners out there. But now we want to do a little something different. We want to show our appreciation for everyone else doing their part, um, the people we call homeliners, who stayed at home and did their part in flattening the curve. Now, uh, we're shining the spotlight once again on Filipino artists, these amazing Pinoys from all over the country who've lifted our spirits during this quarantine. Hey, what's going on? Joining us today on One on One, hashtag One Step Forward. Yo, everyone, please welcome Magnus Haven. How are you guys doing? How are you guys doing? Huh? Hi, guys. What's up? All right. Um, now, I know that... When you Google you, when you Google Magnus Haven, uh, you actually have rock band that pops out, no? But um, for the benefit of our first-time listeners out there, so to be in your bar, rock band kayo, or how exactly would you want to identify if you were to describe Magnus Haven? Um, Raji, what's your take on this? Um, because sa amin, uh, mas madalas na kami uh, nag-experiment kami. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Exper- experimental kami, like gusto namin <clears throat> sa mga kanta namin, nandun lahat, lumalabas lahat. So, mm-hmm. is, uh, pinapakinggan nyo yung mga songs namin, like um, Imahe, and then meron kami Panalangin, meron kami right. Panalangin, iba-iba na kong genre. And, uh, parang gusto namin gawin yung ganun, experimental. But, um, ganit din kami sa point na meron kami talaga certain sound na parang pag narinig, ah, Magnus Haven. Mm-hmm. Oh, I, I I was actually listening to a few of your songs on Spotify, um, and I can actually say I like them. They're very smooth, man. Means nga iniisip ko baka baka naman pang pweding pang romance ato. <laughs> but uh, David, David, what do you think, man? Uh, how do you feel about this whole being experimental thing moving forward? Um, will you always continue doing this? Uh, actually, because uh, in your challenge, Samin, um. Gusto namin, um, kinaklasify namin yung music namin as an alternative alternative rock. Yung mm-hmm, genre mm-hmm, right. Pero, um, we're, we are trying to, uh, to experiment, uh, mix up things. Pero gusto namin na pag narinig ng tao, uh, alam nila sa utak ko nalang bago sa hearing na pinapakinggan nila. Great. And, and masaya naman, masaya. Well, I'm happy that you guys are happy, and so is everybody else. Um, actually, you guys look pretty young, yo. Uh, I know a lot yeah. of bands na college pa lang, nagsama na sila, they already started making music. So, if you can take us on a little bit of a trip, how did you guys come together? Um, how did you form the band, and what really made you stick together? Right. Uh, actually, um, magkababata kasi yung isa, yung dalawa namin band. Oh. Uh-huh. Basis. <clears throat> They're from Pantol Bandizal. And then, uh, parang, they lang, uh, nag, ano sila, nag, lupo sila before. And then, may friend yung lead guitars namin, my manager, <clears throat> na, which happens to be our manager ngayon. Tapos, um, nag, uh, nag-isip sila na baka pwede silang mag-full band. Then, pumasok yung drummer namin. And then, kami dalawa ni, ni David. Dapat nga, ang aming Wow, okay. Two vocalists. Well, it does seem like you two um, still are vocalists. No, you sing on different tracks as well. Um, Actually, sorry, David, what was that? I said, yep. Okay, okay, sorry. Right. um, no, you guys actually sort of switch it up on songs. One sings on another. And which actually leads me to my next point. Now, you have that one song that everybody knows, everybody keeps on talking about. You have an average of like 1.3 monthly listeners on Spotify. And this song, man, Imahe, 44 million hits on Spotify. Uh, is this a song that sort of got the ball rolling for you? Ito ba yung kanta na? Uy! Magnus Haven Palayan, we oh they're pretty good. We should listen to them more. Is it that song for you? Yes, yeah, 
Right, right. Please, David. Yeah. Sobrang, sobrang thankful sa mga sa song na yon. Um, kasi uh, hindi namin siya expect na ganon mm-hmm. blow up. And um, we've been waiting for actually almost one year. Ah, uh, parang nawawala na kami ng ano kasi parang hindi naman siya ganon pinapakinggan ng mga tao. Mm-hmm. Pero there, there came a point na bigla na lang siyang bigla na lang pumataas yung views and streams niya sa YouTube and Spotify. Wow, diba okay. Guys? And from then on, nag-start na, pinagkilik na siya ng mga tao and everything was magic. Oh, okay. That's interesting. That's sort of like the magic of social media nowadays. No, But uh, Raji, I want to get your take on this. Uh, what do you think exactly happened? How did it get up there? Diba? Sinasabi nga ni David, naka one year na yung kata na yun. So, what happened? Actually, para sa akin, ginawa lang namin yung um, talagang usual na ginagawa mm-hmm. ng show time. Um, Siyempre, so, promote yung songs and um, nag, uh, nag, uh, nag-ikig kami sa mga bars para malaman ng ibang tao yung, mm-hmm. yung song namin. And then, um, ano, um, nag, uh, hihingi kami ng tulong sa mga, right. uh, siyempre na sa mga producers, ganyan, siyempre lang para ma, ma, makilala yun ang song, and then sumasali kami sa mga TV, reality shows, like that, para malaman ang tao na kami. And then suddenly nga, hindi namin napansin, na parang, um, wait lang, trivia lang, last year, ngayong month na to, mm-hmm. last year, ang trivia lang sa YouTube ay, Just 300,000 last year. Okay. 2019. What about now? Just going to go and say, parang nasa 11 or 12 million. Oh, yo. But they're talking, oh, dude, talagang ako, talagang nakakapanibago. That's the reason why pinatatakot na siya sa katawan ko. Mm. Yeah. Wow, okay. Okay, that's, that's, That's something you, that's a tattoo you get out of memory, man, to commemorate something. You got to stay on that grind, though. And speaking of staying on that grind, um, with all the time that you guys have had, all the spare time anybody has had recently, were you guys sort of making new music? Did you already have some new concepts? Or are you planning more of doing stuff after everything said it on, after uh, the whole ECQ thing? Uh, yeah, um... Uh, actually, um, we're planning to release uh, songs. Mm, okay. Abangan nyo na lang sila, guys. Okay. Yeah. Um, like, like uh, um, during one, wala kami nagawa sa David. Like, magkaka- mag- magkalayo kami, magkakalayo kami ng band. So, we planned, uh, we started doing some songs na parang, try natin gumawa ng song. Mm-hmm. Everybody heard it here first, man. All right, great. Looking forward to that new music. No, um, actually, speaking of, uh, Raji, I understand that you sang the first song, or you're going to be singing the first song. So, can you please talk about it a little more? Matatapang. Matatapang. Okay. Yeah. Da, yung, kasi sila yung, yung matatapang kasi ang hilig magkunwari, di ba? Ang hilig mm. magpanggap. Para hindi sila makikitaan ng any um, reaction of um, weakness. Ganyan. So, ginawa niya to para sa mga tao. Akala niya uh, kaya niya na mag-isa. Okay? Wow. Yeah. 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 Y
yun na sila. Sila na. Okay? Flow, flow na yung relationship nila na parang asya-asya nila pero hindi pa talaga. So parang ko sa mga tao kapag tuwa, pwede na lang masaya kayo hindi pa talaga sa isa. Well, there you have it, folks. First song for today from Magnus Haven, it's Landas. Oh, 
sabihin Anong nangyari sa atin? There you have it folks, Landas from Magnus Haven and once again you're on one on one hashtag one step forward brought to you by radio stations under the Philippine Broadcasting Service FM1, FM1 Davao, Capital FM2, RP1 and RP2. Yo, Magnus Haven, Landas, that was an awesome song, awesome performance, man. Yo, and it's all for the people out there. You must strong, matatapang. Speaking of, kaya natin to. This entire lockdown, quarantine, COVID-19, we will all get through this together. You know, and I want to actually ask you guys a few questions about how you're dealing with this entire situation. So, um, since we actually heard from Raji singing first, how about I ask you first how the quarantine's been treating you so far? I noticed that you're wearing a cap, actually. I, I wanted to ask you, kung long hair ka sa ilalim, or did you make a mistake with your haircut? <laughs> no, no, no. No? Uh, actually, kung pa, it's a big challenge para sa akin. Kasi I'm not an indoor person. So, I usually go out para sa mga kasama ko, mga friends ko. Hmm. Nasa nila, kaya nasa kapit ako. So, ang hirap sa akin, ang nasa a big challenge para sa akin. Like, nandito lang ako sa throne ako, like, Okay. Well, uh, well, it doesn't look like it doesn't look like David's. Uh, no, it doesn't look like David uh, shaved his hair off. Uh, David, um, I don't know if you're also an extrovert like uh, Raji over there. But what are the things? Uh, what are some of the things you're doing right now during quarantine? I know, binge watch ka ba ng Netflix or any shows? Are you reading any books? What is it that you're up to? We do workout. Ayan, palagi kami nag-workout. Workout, okay. Sobrang saya mag-workout. Uh, sobrang saya magpapawis pala sa bahay. Para matagtag ka kasi parang buong araw mo <laughs> nakahiga, di ba? So, kailangan mo rin naman kung... Kailangan mo rin naman gisingin yung mga joints mo at mga muscle mo para uh, may ginagawa sila ngayon yung quality. And also, nanonood din kami ng mga, ano, ng mga movies, series. Sobrang dami magaganda. Right, right. And may gains ka man from all the working out at home. Man to man. Oh, there we go. He's flexing his bicep. Yo, okay. Uh, how about uh, how about this other type of flex? All right. After the after the quarantine period, talking about the new normal, it's been in the conversation a lot. No, um, any future any future plans for Magnus Haven with the new normal being in place? Uh, David, let's hear from you. Actually, um, what are we gonna do now is we're gonna cope up with the flow on paano mag-work ang music industry ngayon. Right. Uh, after, ng, after ng quarantine dahil let's accept the fact na uh, magiging, mababalik ang mga gigs, mga mass gatherings pag nagkakaroon na ng vaccine. Right, And right. Ngayon, the challenge is um, how can you be relevant with the situation Right. It's uh, it's going to be a little bit of a challenge for the music industry, for everybody working in freelance, whatever the case may be. But really, right now, while we're still in quarantine, I know a lot of the frontliners out there are experiencing this daily challenge, this daily struggle. Um, now there have been a lot of ways recently to to help frontliners and everybody in need of donation drives. Other operations uh, from their own homes, diba? Have you personally participated in anything like this, Raji? Yeah, I don't come in fundraising project, Magnus Heart. Magnus so, Heart. I'm, uh, I'm glad that many people and many people have done a lot of work. So it's for all the frontliners and all the family, uh, the families of the poorest of the poor. Right. So, Mm-hmm. 
doon sa mga protagonist sa mga Japan. Nice! So, that's something na talagang overwhelming para sa aming mga kapitin. Nice, and nice. Sa bahay. And ayun, magkakahiwalay, nakakatulong pa rin kami. Magnus Haven, pushing it forward, man. Um, I understand that uh, David, oh, David over here already has told us na may gains na siya with all these workouts and everything. But Raji, is there any piece of advice that you can give to anyone battling with boredom, you know, while being in quarantine? Oh, oh. hey, I think, you know, okay. Um, uh, Inexplored ko yung bahay. Like, Inexplored mo yung bahay. What did you find, man? <laughs> maraming gamit ng mga lumang gamit. Like, guys, ko alam na may ganun pa ng room dito. <laughs> Explore nyo lang, pati yung buhay nyo sa bahay, no? kaya nyo palang mag-stay sa bahay na mm-hmm. buong araw. And ako, akin ko akala ay nakayong mag-diet. Buti ka ba? Kaya kala ko kasi um, pag lalo pag quarantine, kakain ka rin, kakain kasi lagi ka boring. Mm-hmm. Board, so, uh, ako parang na-realize ko na mas kailangan ko magpapayan. Lalo mo yung quarantine kasi after this um, lockdown, syempre maraming <laughs> times na pwede tayo kumain sa labas. It's more um, uh, unhealthy, di ba? So, <laughs> sobra na kayo. Para tayo, explore nyo lang. Explore nyo lang yung buhay nyo. Lalo na yun. Nas- naka- alam natin kung sino. And enjoy, enjoy your time with your family. Kasi syempre, um, Ayun, kasi eh, sa trabaho tayo. Like, mm-hmm, uh, mm-hmm. Sa trabaho tayo, we, have, we don't have enough, enough time para ma, uh, makausap or makabond ang ating family. So, ngayon, the best time para That's right. eh, makabonding natin. Yeah. Absolutely. You know. um, again, it's it's always a time that not many people have. So, enjoy the time with your family while you can and um, Raji talking about all his dieting and everything, you have me checking myself out, bro. <laughs> Come on, man. David, what about you? Uh, working out at home. Is that really something that you wanted to do ever since the start of the lockdown? Or can you recommend any particular workouts for our listeners out there? Okay, I'm going to give you a tip. <laughs> Please do. <laughs> um, work out, um, uh, personally, this is what I do. I work out six days a week and I rest for a day. Um, no. Oh, man. And um, my muscle uh, program ko, pinagsasabay ko is my chest and tricep. And that's my first day. My second day is my uh, back and bicep. And on the third day, I work out my legs and shoulder and my abs. I work it every day kasi sa mga <laughs> kinakain. All right, so um, everybody's dieting, everybody's uh, working out okay, man. I hear you, but uh, what's the first thing? What's the first thing you're going to be doing after the quarantine's been lifted, uh, David? The first thing that I that I'll do. Kasi masado ako na deprived na yun sa mga sa mga fast food. Kakain ka na. Right. And lalo na to, alam ko lahat ng tao gustong gusto. Sam Gibson, guys. Unlimited. Okay, understatement. Right. I see you. Okay. Um, now, moving back into the into sort of music talk, Raji, um, I know you guys have sort of been describing your efforts or what the music scene's going to be like, but in your own personal homes, no? Raji, are there any local artists you've been listening to during the quarantine period? <laughs> oh, so and dayo nito para sa akin. And dayo nito sa band. But nakikinig ko OPM like um uh, sa sa Spotify, yung mga top hits Philippines, yung mga nandoon lang. Mm, okay. Right. Ako ngayon kasi ako yung kasi sa mga yung kasi sa lullaby song. Lullaby. Songs na Korean dramas like Crash Land, you know, like that. So, I'm 
tinatanggap ko ngayon talaga, sobrang layo sa akin. Which is yung mga songs sa Gary. Yung mga um, classic piano song. Mga classic piano yung mga mm-hmm. um, instrumental. So parang sobrang relaxing lang sa akin. Right, and you guys actually... Right, uh, thank you. And uh, you guys actually have um, some relaxing songs of your own. Personally, we'd like to thank you for being part of uh, Juan on Juan. Uh, hashtag Juan Step Forward. Now, everybody out there, please remember to continue showing support for our local musicians, just like Magnus Haven, by going to their sites, listening and sharing their songs, uh, bugging our stations to play their music. Uh, no, they're also uh, selling uh, some shirts out there, which you can also copy. Y'all gotta send me that link as well, man. Please do. And uh, while we can still help in fighting the virus, even if we're not in the front lines, please stay indoors unless absolutely necessary. If you must go out, bear essentials, please, okay? So we've gotten up close and personal with uh, Magnus Haven. Now that you know them better, how we give a listen to their music on our stations uh, fm1 fm1 davao capital fm2 rp1 and rp2 david you're singing the next song how about you tell us a little more about it yes uh, this song is actually a product of our uh, uh, own experiences and uh, gusto namin makatulong at mm-hmm. makapaghantod man sa mga Papa nating Philippine tao during this pandemic crisis na nararanasan natin. Kaya kaya nagawa namin itong patang to. Kahit sobrang hirap, sobrang hirap namin siya bago paano namin siya i-record. Pero nagawa namin siya ng paraan guys. Uh, all for you. This song is a uh, hope song na ipapakinda natin at mapapagawa sa ating mga loob. This song is entitled Santuario sa Santuario. Beautiful message, man. David, Raji, thank you. It's Magnus Haven Sanctuario. Oh 
Lord, no gigita pa. Huwag mawala na pag-asa. Kailangan lang natin magkaisa. sa ating sarili sa likod ng ating maskara magkataya ang bukas ng bansa sa mayon hanggang Sa ating sarili